hello guys hi welcome again to my channel so here i am today in the same place where i come every week which is alcaria auctions so today i've come to check out the new collection and most of my friends have told me uh, to shoot cars that are suv that are pickup trucks but people who really like going off-roading so they're really interested uh, to get to know about the bigger cars as compared to the small or the luxury uh, cars so here i'm today and i'm going to be shooting cars uh, that are scv and pickup trucks so stay tuned till the end because you're going to find it fruitful and let's get started so for all those who have interests uh, on a hyundai palisade here is one which is a 2021 model, starting price 59,000 AED. As you can see, the front side of the car is really great. There isn't uh, much damage except some scratches and some dirt on the front grille. If you go at the back side, that's where the most uh, damage is. As you can see, this car got hit from behind and I would say a very bad one. So you can have a look at the back. I mean, the whole thing got pushed in. I guess it must be a truck. Uh, the truck must have hit this car somehow from the back and the whole thing just went in. You could even see the, the motherboard of the, the tail light over here and the whole session is just like in. Even the, the rear suspension has been kicked in and as you can see the trunk is, uh, you can see in a, a very bad shape and um, it's mostly the, the, the rear section. So this is a condition of this uh, Hyundai Palisade. <clears throat> it's a black color. If you go inside, I don't think the airbags popped. As you can see, the airbag did not pop because it's just a, a rear end uh, damage. But instead of a Hyundai Palisade, it's really beautiful. Full black interior, black leather, and uh, it's full option with a sunroof, as you can see. It's a beautiful car. If you know how to fix it in that Palisade, I would say go for this car over here. 2021 Palisade. Here we have a Land Rover Discovery, which is a 2018 model. And a starting price for this car is 36,000 uh, dirhams. It's white color. Uh, the front is really uh, great. There is no accident. As you can see, it's uh, from England. That's where it's been imported from, I guess, Copart. We go back to see the damage it's got banana over here on the side that's where the damage is it's got a side hit somehow uh car uh, got hit from the side and you can see the condition is how it looks like <clears throat> even over here a spare uh, tire that's been put on the car it's a sport edition of discovery as you can see so that was the only place of damage on the side for this Land Rover uh, Discovery. It's really a beautiful car starting only at 36,000 uh, uh, dirhams. If you open the door and go inside, there is no air damage except on the seat on that side. And look at the beautiful panoramic um, uh, roof. It's so beautiful in here with the black interior. So this is the Land Rover Discovery for you guys. <clears throat> it's a beautiful car, um, reliable car, a good off-road car, and uh, it's really an opportunity, I would say, a great opportunity. Here we have an interesting car, which is a Kia Telluride, a 2021 with a, a grayish, a bullet uh, gray, I would say, color, with the front end damage, grill is missing, front bumper is missing. Uh, there's a crack on the windshield and um, there's a broken side uh, mirror as you can see the suspension has just failed it's like the wheel is leaning towards the inside and there's this whole rust on the side over here going all the way to the back with a spare tire being put there's also a damage on the back side I mean it's really a, a huge car this uh, a Kia Telluride if we go on this side, we can see that uh, there is no damage and it's an all-wheel uh, drive uh, car as you can see over here starting with 63,000 dirhams for this uh, Telluride 2021 model. It's really a beautiful combination of uh, black and uh, 
gray uh, color. And as you can see from inside, there is airbag damage. And I just opened the door and there was a crack and it was a very bad one though. And there is a, a steering wheel airbag damage. There's a knee airbag damage. And uh, surprisingly, there's no roof airbag damage. So it is also one on that side that got popped and the dashboard damage. A nice SUV, a Kia Telluride. It's a beautiful car, a good opportunity to grab. And I would recommend people to go for this car. Here we got a Nissan Rogue 2017 model, starting price 17,500. Beautiful color. Uh, there's a damage on the front hood. It's really not in place. Or maybe it's just open, I have not realized it. There's also damage on the front uh, bumper, as you can see. If you go towards the back, there's a damage over here. The side uh, fender is coming off. And the back side of the car looks like it's in good condition. There's no damage on the back side of the car. Let's go on the side and see what's happening. Nothing. So it's just a front uh, damage. I think it rolled over or something because I really cannot see any damage on the body. So I'm really surprised why the airbags popped then. I mean, if there's no damage on the body, why did the airbags pop? All of them. It's really like a mystery, a mystery to me right now. Here we have a 2019 Jeep uh, Cherokee, white color. Uh, came all the way from Naples, turn, which mentioned on on the number plate. I wonder where is that in the USA? As you can see, the damage is on the front uh, fender. There's a missing uh, piece over here. And as we go towards the back, we can see that um, there is no damage. It's really clean, clean back. And let's go inside and see what's happening. Here we go with the airbags, as you can see. Steering air, airbag gone, dash board airbag gone. Um, no roof airbag, which is a good thing. And a knee airbag also gone. For all the Jeep lovers, this is a great car. You can go for it. A Jeep Cherokee 2019. Moving on here, we got a, a Chevrolet Trail uh, Blazer. It's a 2021 model with 24,500 as the starting bid. It's the back uh, looks like in great condition, even though it doesn't have a number plate. As we go forward, we can see that the damage is mainly on the front side. As you can see, it got hit in the middle over here with the missing grille, front bumper. And the good part is that both the headlights and the fog lights are there, which is a good thing, except the front uh, hood got hit over here. So it needs a hood, a front bumper. And the side skirt seem to be in good condition, as you can see. It even has a broken uh, windshield. And if we go inside, let's have a look. There is a blown airbag on the steering wheel and on the knee, knee airbag. And also a dashboard airbag. This is all the damage on this car, on this Chevy Trail Blazer 2021 model. Here we got a Jeep Compass 2020 model. 4x4 uh, variant starting at 27,500 with this solid uh, color. It's a beautiful color. Uh, the damage is mainly on the front side, as you can see how bad it is, including a broken uh, windshield, a damage, a really damaged uh, hood, no fender, no front bumper, radiator system is all bad. It's all bent in with a surviving front headlight. And um, if we go inside and see that, uh, of course, uh, blown uh, steering wheel airbag and the front dash airbag blown. It's uh, in a dirty condition because of the broken uh, window, uh, windshield, I would say. But it's really a beautiful car. Jeep Compass is really a car that is uh, demanded here in the UAE. And it's a 4x4 and can go 
most of the terrain, so it's really like a car in demand. For all the Nissan lovers out there, here we got a Nissan Pathfinder uh, 2020 model starting at 46,000. Uh, Durham's beautiful silver color. As you can see, there's no front damage. Uh, the body is in good condition. It's in good condition until we reach the back where the major, where it took the major hit. As you, you can see, it got the bamboo in. Uh, the whole side, the passenger side, just went all in, and even the back trunk it got uh, um, deformed. Like it's not, it, it won't close because of the damage to the the chassis. So this is the condition. It's a four-wheel drive SL Nissan Pathfinder, a very good uh, model a variant, I would say. But as you can see, the back suspension, this wheel is just facing inside, which shows the damage to the suspension and the chassis. So the body is in good condition, but the suspension or the consider undercarriage is really in bad condition for this car. Here we got a 2017 Kia Sportage with starting price of 23,500 dirhams. This beautiful brownish golden color. As you can see, the damage is on the front side with both the headlights being taken off and uh, damage to the hood. As you can see how it looks like. The front bumper seems to be in good condition, but the grille seems to have been smacked, as you can see over here. And if you go towards the back of the car, we can see that it's just a front end damage. The back seems to be in good condition. 2017 model Sportage FE variant, starting price 23,500 only which is not much for its car, as it really has a great resale value. If you go inside, we can see that the, the damage, there's a steering wheel airbag damage, no roof airbag damage, which is a good thing. So you only have to change the steering wheel airbag dam damage and the dashboard is in good condition. Overall, a good car, a good SUV. To make it road worthy again, you just have to spend like one or two thousand uh, dirhams and you can have a Sportage for yourself. All right guys, so that was it for today's video. I showed you guys all the SUVs available over here. So uh, anyone who has interest in buying these cars, you can get in contact with me. I can give you the best price for SUVs here in Dubai and how you can get these cars to your destination wherever you are in this world. And uh, let me know what kind of cars you want me to shoot the videos on because over here, the different kind of cars ranging from SUVs, from hatchbacks, from sedans, so all types of cars available over here. And I'd just like to serve you guys and give you the best information available. So on that note, thank you for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed today's content and see you guys on the next one.